have to look at the camera like this. Oh. Can you say hi to the camera? Say yeah. hi, friends. Hi there. Welcome to the video. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. This might not work. You have to wait, honey. Here. Okay. Hold on. Oh, there's a Zoe down there. Oh. Let's try it this way. Hello, you guys. We, meaning myself, Liam, <laughs> my hair in my mouth, and Ben are about to brave cost to the co, i.e. Costco. And uh, I thought that I would show you guys what we get. I may or may not vlog in Costco, but this is gonna be a Costco haul. I recently did a little survey on Instagram, seeing like what kind of stuff you guys wanna see. It was mostly in terms of Instagram, but a lot of you guys told me stuff for YouTube, and a lot of you guys actually said like grocery, shopping, haul, food related things. And so I thought I would just do a little Costco haul. That's what's in today's video. So most people will probably be here for the title of Costco haul. And if you don't want to stay for more than that, that is fine. But I encourage you to because it's cool around here. I think. Because <laughs> he's here. So if you guys want to subscribe, that'd be cool. We're trying to get back into the swing of YouTube. Means like, what is happening? So we'll probably see you at Costco. I want to look at couches. Um, actually, because our couch is a hand-me-down couch, which has served us so well for the last like five years, but it's it's worn out and it's time to get a new couch. Like it's not really what I want to spend money on, but Costco has some really good couches. So I want to see, this is what we have right now in case anyone is new around here. Let me show you. This is our couch with laundry on it because like story of a mom life, right? Um, but we, I really want to get like a, uh, dark gray couch. It will cover stains a little better and I just think it would flow better with our house. <laughs> so we'll see you a little bit later. Hey, will you smile? <laughs> garbage cans. Liam's favorite thing at Costco is the garbage cans. Are you eating that? Is that good? I'm trying to find him some sample. We don't have any. Hi you guys, same spot, different outfit. It got really hot, so I have to change. I have to go to the dentist really soon, which I'm not happy about. So I'm gonna try to do this haul before I have to go to the dentist. Um, so Ben put some stuff away, some stuff's on the counter, some stuff's in the fridge, some stuff's in the garage. So we're gonna have to go around and show you what I got. Um, we did find, I think we found everything that was on our list. And we picked up a couple of other things. Some of these things are things that we buy every single time and some of them are new to us. So I'm excited to show you guys what I got. So in no particular order, I'm just gonna start with what's in front of me. Okay, the first thing we got are these coconut clusters, which are organic, non-GMO. They are made with pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds, chia seeds. These are something we've actually never tried before. So I'm excited to try them. Gluten-free, organic, vegan, pretty much all the things we want and all organic ingredients here. Really quickly, I should add a quick side note that for the most part, we try to buy organic, non-GMO, like minimally processed. Like obviously we're buying processed foods, but we try to buy the ones that have better ingredients, real ingredients in them. I try to avoid artificial dyes as much as I can. Um, I've kind of taken on like a hippie lifestyle a little bit, not really. I think that this is just the direction that the world should go into it shouldn't be considered hippie but like if you don't follow me on instagram i haven't talked about it a whole lot on here but i'm like really into like essential oils and non-toxic products i've been trying to switch out all of the conventional products with like chemicals and fragrance for non-toxic alternatives i've seen a big improvement in my health since doing so and so i've been working on slowly trying to do that with food too so buying more organic minimally processed no dyes as much as we can obviously not everything because i still like my junk food and like ice cream and all of that but like every little bit helps so just so you know and ben is like on a health kick right now so we're trying to buy things that are a little bit better for us um if you guys are interested in like non-toxic and like wellness and oils and that kind of thing i'll put my oils instagram here i have a separate account for all of that stuff so 
if you're like wow those look like a treat that's like does not sound good to me because that's so healthy that's like what we're trying to go for um but i have no idea if they're good i would try one right now but i just brushed my teeth for the dentist so that's gonna have to hold next up this is mostly for ben i'm not the biggest beef jerky fan i mean i'll eat it if i like really need an extra dose of protein but he really likes these they're individually packaged these are made with steak they're gluten-free which i like because teriyaki sauce a lot of the time is not gluten-free but this teriyaki flavor is high in protein no nitrates one package has 13 grams of protein in the one pack and 12 in the other so this is something we've purchased quite a few times in the past so these are for Lian. I showed these in his What I Eat in a Day video. They're organic fruit and vegetable pouches. They're pretty small, so I just like them as like a quick snack. He usually gets it after nap time. It's kind of just part of his routine. This one comes with two different flavors. Again, they're gluten-free. There's no added sugar, and they're just a simple and easy thing. He loves pouches, so we always get a pack of these now. Next up is this big bag of almonds. We got one of these last time and went through it all. Um, again, just a really good snack, good protein. Ben likes to bring these to work. I like to eat them with crackers just throughout the day. I have such a hard time getting enough calories in throughout the day because I'm like always busy with lean. I don't have time to make stuff. So sometimes I'll just like quickly grab a handful of these and some crackers. Let me show you the crackers that I actually usually eat these with. We didn't buy more of them this time, but they are from Costco. Apparently we're out of the crackers I usually eat them with, which I didn't realize or we would have bought more. If you're at Costco, they're like, in this big blue bag, they are gluten-free and they're like little bagel chips almost. They're not like thick, they're thin, but they have like poppy seeds and like all kinds of things like a little bagel. So if you see those, get them, they're really good with almonds. Lean and I eat a lot of granola bars. It's usually like our snack after breakfast. Um, and we thought we'd give these a try. We've never tried these before, they're for kids, but I'm gonna eat them too. Chocolate and peanut butter, less sugar, they're organic, whole grain. They are gluten-free and they also have good fiber, which is good because Lean gets constipated sometimes. I mean, real life. So I'm interested to see not only how he likes them, but how I like them. I didn't even realize, but Ben also bought big bags of jerky, which I'm assuming he will plan to eat at home. And then the little packs will be for him to take to work. So same kind. So these are Ben's. He likes them. Like I said, he's on like a health kick and he's been going to the gym. And so he needs extra protein. So these are what he eats. He got two different boxes with different flavors. I haven't personally tried these. I don't even know if I can. Actually, I do think they're gluten-free. They are. Um, and I take it back. I did try one once, but... Oh, they say gluten-free right there. But it's just not really my jam. But if you are someone that needs extra protein, he really likes these. We buy them every time. So popping into our fridge, they're all like condensated right now. But we got a big box of organic strawberries. Lean love strawberries. I like to have them on hand. So I buy them pretty much every time I go to the store. So when we can get them from Costco for like a super good deal, this was like five bucks for the whole thing, then we always do. Also got organic blueberries. These are mostly for Ben. He really likes to eat them in his yogurt. I'm not actually the biggest blueberry fan. Lean is so-so about them. Sometimes he likes them, sometimes he doesn't. So these are mostly for Ben, but it's kind of funny because when I was pregnant, I craved blueberries all the time. Again, this was a super good deal. Organic fruit at Costco is such a steal. We also got this shredded Parmesan cheese. This is a staple in our house. I can't even tell you how many times we've been at Costco recently and have forgotten to get this. And every time we're like, we need Parmesan cheese. We're like, oh my God, we forgot to get it again. So this is a staple. Finally remembered it this time. Into our little drawer, we got three packs of lunch meat. So oven roasted turkey breast, smoked turkey breast, and honey ham. Lunch meat is one of those things that actually is weird. Like ingredients are kind of scary in some lunch meats, which I never even realized until recently. And so these ones have pretty good ingredients. Deli meat is like a lot of the times very processed and has a lot of random crap in it but these ones were pretty good um and then this is a favorite of ours these little balls of mozzarella cheese they come in individual packs with three balls leanne loves these zoe i swear she heard that they came out and wants one loves these they're really really good ben loves to take them to work they're a perfect little snack this is another favorite for Ben. He gets them every time we go. He brings them to lunch. They're individual packs of tuna that you can just eat like right out of. It's like a little bag. You can just eat it right out of the bag. 26 grams of protein per pouch. I've tried them too. Um, they're pretty good. He does add like mustard and mayonnaise to them, but you don't have to. Another great option for like quick lunch ideas. And they are like 
really good about testing for mercury. They test every single fish, which is important. It says that they are pure for athletes, kids, and pregnant women, which is important. Last but not least, we've come out into the garage in the yellow lighting. These gluten-free pizzas. Sabatasso's, you guys, the best gluten-free pizza ever, 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 ever. I love to put anything on them. I'll do peppers, olives, chicken, buffalo sauce, all the things. Try these pizzas if you're gluten-free. Ben thinks they're the best frozen pizza there is, and he is usually not a fan of gluten-free. He always says that gluten-free tastes different. These ones he loves. And then we also got these for just quick and easy. Um, I've tried these before, but we've never got them at Costco. They're just a quick bowl for lunch or for dinner that have potatoes, sausage, cage-free eggs, cheddar cheese, and bacon. Super easy and fast. And then last but not least, our drinks fridge, <laughs> which is a little wild right now. So Ben got beer. I'm obviously allergic. And then our drinks, we always get our Crystal Geyser bubble waters. Um, we really like to mix these with our Ningxia, which is like a antioxidant drink, and then Spindrift, which is like our favorite to just drink on their own. I drink these on their own too, because it's just easier to carry around than a can, but we really love the Spindrifts because they are made with real fruit. Like if you look at this, natural lemon essence. So these and most flavored waters are made with fruit essence, whereas these are made with real squeezed fruit. So there's one and a half grapefruits in a can, or two lemons in a can, or 65 raspberries and one lime in a can. So we love that. Okay, you guys, so that is everything that we got at Costco. I'm excited to try a couple of new things. A lot are things that we've tried before. I would love to know if you guys have any favorites from what I showed you, or if there's anything that you like to get from Costco that I did not show. Tell me, oh, you know what? We also got chicken wings. I forgot to show you that. We also got chicken wings because we got an air fryer and we've been liking to make chicken wings in the air fryer. I forgot to mention actually one other thing is that we did see a couch there that I did like. Um, it was dark gray. I would like it maybe even a little bit darker and I think that it's a little too small for our space. So we're gonna keep looking. We're not in any rush, but I'm just getting ideas. So that one's like in the back of my head for future, but it wasn't like, Oh my god, I love this couch. This is the one. Let's get it. So in case you're all wondering about the couch, because I'm sure you're really invested in my couch. Okay, guys, so that's going to be it for this video. Tell me if you liked this. I can do other grocery type hauls in the future. I can do more Costco hauls. This was just something that was requested. So I thought I'd give it a try. I don't think I've ever done like a formal grocery haul on my channel before. So give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Don't forget to tell me your favorite Costco products. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I have my personal account and my wellness account. I had a couple of people comment on my last video saying like, oh, we've been wondering where you've been and all that. I'm on Instagram a lot more, so you can follow me there. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.